Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So currently in the stable version of Google Chrome for desktop. As I've posted previously, and as many of you may well know, if we head over to YouTube as an example, and I double right click on that video that is playing, we get two options available. The first being save video frame as, where I can save that video frame as a PNG image to my local drive, or we can copy video frame. Now it seems that Google is thinking of taking these options one step further where they are adding a third option now where you can search video frame with Google which is now being tested and is available in Chrome Canary which is a early preview version. Now as you can see it's not available as yet in the stable version but if we pop over to Chrome Canary 125 the latest preview and we head to YouTube and I do the same. I double right click over and above having the first option available, save video frame as, and then the next copy video frame, we now get the third option, search video frame with Google, which is now enabled by default in Chrome Canary. And if we click on that entry, search video frame with Google, that opens up a search in the side panel using Google Lens where you can find image source, you can do related searches and expand your search regarding that image. So if these are uh, uh, features you have been using previously in the stable version, then you may find this of benefit and use when it makes its way down to stable. And I personally do think uh, it will make its way to stable. There is no reason why not, because uh, in the stable version, we already get the first two options save video frame as and copy video frame which have become available which were first tested in Chrome Canary so there's no reason why um, I feel this will not make its way down to the stable and I think if this is uh, um, something you are using on a regular basis as an example if you are already using the save video frame and copy video frame I think that search video frame with Google could be a nice move in the right direction and personally I don't think it would be something I would use but nonetheless if you do find that useful then that's been tested and should make its way down eventually in a version or two's time to Chrome Stable. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.